In this video, I'm going to show you how to create an invoice from a task and then push it into QuickBooks Online. First thing we need to do is go into the task. So to get into the task, just double click the task number that's listed in blue. That'll bring you into the task details. You'll notice down there that, that this task does have a charge already associated with it. If we want to see what we're being charged for, just click on the line items. And notice that we have coffee and we have salt in here. Once you have everything that you want in there, the next step is to go ahead and um, invoice this task. So you have to have a resolution. I want to say task is complete, please invoice. From here, you just click the invoice button along the top of the task. You'll get a pop-up that asks you'd like to create an invoice. You're going to hit yes. And now you're going to have an invoice that's created. You'll notice that we have an extra item that we did not have before. This is actually something that the software does for you. It's going to create a notes item which does not have a charge. No tax related to it, no charge. What it's got in here is it has the description of the task when we first set it up. And if we click in there and hit the down arrow, we're going to see that the resolution is also there. It's just basically extra information for your customers to see when they get the invoice. This can be removed if you don't want it by clicking this gray box here and hitting delete on the keyboard and then yes to confirm. But for this video, I'm just going to go ahead and post this to QuickBooks. Once you've reviewed the invoice, the, really the last step here is just make sure you're signed into QuickBooks Online. As long as you're signed in and you're ready, you're just going to hit post to QuickBooks. You're going to get a pop-up that asks if you'd like to invoice it. Yes, I would. The system's going to run for a few minutes. And you're going to have a posted to QuickBooks up here. You're going to notice this big box here highlights. We're going to go ahead and click OK to start syncing with QuickBooks Online. You missed a pop up there. Now you'll notice it filled in this black check mark or black circle here where it says posted to QuickBooks. That's your indication that this has made it to the QuickBooks Online um, side. And from there, you can go ahead and invoice your customers as you normally do. The invoice will be there in QuickBooks Online. Go ahead and print it or email it or do whatever your normal process is. And that's how you post a task to an invoice and then post that to QuickBooks.